Hello, hello. We have a risk. Uh, not too sure who all the players are. Other than Frenetic. Uh, yeah. Is that blue guy? Drunky drunk. <laughs> yeah, I literally haven't seen any other... Maybe Tim Bob. But yeah, I haven't seen any of these players, so... Ass gangster. <laughs> Nice. All right, we'll see if these guys are up to par. We shall see. Uh, is that frenetic? Yep, white going for Europe, as he likes to do. Oh boy, it's kind of laggy. Hopefully that's not me. Ever since uh, the old Corona, uh, everyone's internet is being absurdly used, I think. Who knows? Who knows? No one's said anything so far, so I don't know. No one set the uh, latency either. Can I do that? No, I can't. It's already set. It's already set. He's uh, making a tank, so Europe is secure. Could be a quick one if these guys aren't pros. Could be. No one even going for Australia. That's pretty unusual. And then we got Africa, but for some reason they're not taking uh, Middle East. Where's this? No, oh, this must be the Middle East, right? Or is this? I don't know. There, it's finally getting that. Only four Marines, though. Purple could definitely put an end to that if he was being a dick about it. Uh, but yeah, as you can see. Four Marines barely able to do to uh, to a move into that. So gotta be careful. Don't want to just send a few Marines willy nilly and get owned by the cannon. Oh boy, blue being annoying for teal. Teal had South America, but uh, blue apparently wants it. So now teal's gone for Australia. I uh, like. <clears throat> like that decision. <clears throat> uh, yeah, not really much or not much resistance towards white here, and based on what I just saw, I don't think red is super pro. He's got a Goliath. He's got lings. Oh boy, and he's even saving up some minerals. Be bad news for all these folks. Oh, nice uh, little counter here, though, but I don't really think it's going to work, is the problem. Yeah, he just, <laughs> just pulls right on back, and uh, yeah. Not the best. You got to keep an eye on things, too. When you're about here and you see that he's pulling back here, just stop the attack. Just don't even bother. Because <clears throat> you know it's not going to work. So you should attack when you think it's going to work. Logic. But, can't blame him for trying. It was a nice idea. <clears throat> also don't want to be producing wings when you're... Uh, and you got two Goliaths parked right there. And that is just a waste of money. Okay, Teal... Killing something. I guess something came after Teal there. Not too sure what would have, but... Interesting. Maybe Blue? And Blue and Teal are both fighting over the... The measly continents. 
And meanwhile, white's taken over. And North America is still unclaimed. Orange does have a Goliath. Him and yellow have been scrapping for a while, it seems like. And you might just get North America, but it's kind of a little... A little, little too late, if you know what I'm saying. Because, yeah, now... White probably won't do this, but he could take out Greenland. And, uh... It's just spread quite thin as orange. But yeah, considering white has a lot of the map, he doesn't really want to disturb orange. Unless he can just wipe him out, which honestly he probably could. But no rush. No rush on that. And now he's got Africa. Yeah, this is not looking good. These players are kind of derping around. And white knows what he's doing, so... <clears throat> I was a betting man, definitely bet on white here. I guess orange would be the second bet, but even him, yeah, I don't know, weak Goliath, he's been saving a bit of money, no one has a probe yet though, so yeah. White has 16 territories, I believe that's at least 15 minerals, if not 17. And uh, he's just kind of getting a bunch of aggro, isn't he? Okay, Purple knows what he's doing somewhat, he's getting Goliaths. He's going to be able to get some aggro this way, kill some ghosts, take some stuff. Maybe he's even planning to go for Australia or something, because yeah, Teal... Teal and blue here have been scrapping, but they don't really look too pro, and there we go, that's what we're talking about. As soon as he brought up marines, that's kind of the, uh, the trigger for white to enter, because he knows he can get aggro, as well as prevent orange from having a continent, so... Pretty prime time, he gets to take out units, get aggro, and put a stop to orange. Which is really his only competition, which is kind of scary considering he's only got three Goliaths, one one really weak one. And White's going to have a lot of lings. He hasn't upgraded quite yet. So he's just <laughs> telling him to go back. I don't know if he's going to listen to that. you got to ask a little kinder, I think. I don't know. Now, Purple's going this way, but White saw it coming, and he's probably got enough units. There's not much backup for these glass. The two tanks are going to put a stop to that. He probably could do this, but he's going to want like something else. Like, okay, <laughs> now Teal's being silly. What is Teal doing? Holy cow. He's also doing this with blue. Yeah, these guys are a little silly, I think. Not too sure about this game. Even a 5th, 6th, and 7th Goliath, I believe? Is that true? There's 3 here. 6. I guess just 6 for now. He had them slightly split up. Yeah, I think that's... Yeah. And now he's heading back into... Oh, this guy left. <laughs> Even worse! Now it's literally only... Only orange. Yeah, the ass gangster. Poor guy. Farted too hard, I guess. Ripped a hole in the jeans. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. And yeah, there's really... Really nothing these guys can do. White's just gonna... Kind of steamroll. Don't really see any other way around it. Uh... Purple's gonna try. What's he doing actually? He's got two tanks with four glass. Killing the AI, because why not? Little does he know that there's a bunch of lings and glass that can take him out at any moment. Yeah, he's heading home, I'm assuming. Oh, he's not heading home. I was gonna say, I'm assuming he's gonna go for orange again, but orange is all the way down here, so he's not even that worried. You can also head into South America and hit orange that way, so 
Too much stuff, too many options. Four white. It's all over. It's all over, short of him uh, going AFK for five minutes. It's all over. No ifs, ands, or buts. He's even got uh, plus six. That's pretty brutal. That's going to help him take out oranges, goliaths, and uh, purples. Purple's got nothing. Now blue's lagging up. Uh, but he recovers. So maybe blue was the lagger all along. He is drunky drunk, so you know. The implications of that name. Who knows? Uh, yeah, an orange has been killing the AI. Somewhat rightfully so, but look, he's taking damage to the AI. Gonna lose a Goliath, maybe? I think so. Well, he does uh, micro, so nice job there. But kind of irrelevant. It's uh, one, one Goliath shot away from death, so it doesn't really matter if it lives or dies. Um, probably actually better to let that Goliath die to the AI instead of, uh, instead of white. Because, of course, you get five gas for that. Five gas per Goliath kill. Up until 20. Once you get 20 Goliath, Goliath kills, it counts as... Uh, uh, hmm. I believe it counts as 1.4... These are hero glass, they're worth 1400 on the kill score. Uh, and each marine is, is 100. So, so, yeah, every 10 marine kills you at one gas. So, therefore, once the trigger runs out for 20 glass, it'll, it'll uh, count up uh, 1.4 gas, I guess, but it only triggers every two, or <laughs> what am I trying to say? You only get the gas per per 10 marines, so I guess you kill a Goliath and then six more marines and you get your second gas. So I think that's how that would work. Otherwise, you get five gas until you kill 20 or over, I think. Some versions They've added more, so it's like 25, 30, but that's kind of the awkward thing is you gotta do a manual trigger for each kill, so you gotta do one kill, two kill, three kill, equals five gas. Yeah, it's kind of annoying, but 20 seems pretty good. It's pretty rare to kill much more than that in the game, so I guess that's why they chose that. And yep, it's all over, man. It's all over. Purple did, I guess, get um, Australia. And white is out of position, so if he acts quick, he could he could get a handle on stuff. Like he could uh, <coughs> could take out Ukraine or something like that. And that would actually do something. But for now, he's just kind of dilly-dallying a little, isn't he? And yeah, white's getting ready. Nice little mass of glass for orange, but uh, there's more for white, and he's got ling upgrades now too, so that's also bad. No marine upgrades, but okay, so he's just going to close off this end. It's going to be easy to break, though. He's got no marine upgrades. So I don't know if... Uh, I'm too sure if this will work out, but... He's opting to go for Asia instead. Why not? Going to get some easy aggro that way. And you can take out purple. Oh, and purple did go for Ukraine. Okay, so... Purple seems pretty solid, all in all. At least he knows... Kind of how the game works, and how you... You gotta take down the leader if you can. Oh, where's this force there? So he's in Africa. He's not really defending Europe, but he doesn't really need to at this point. You can just keep his uh, his tank marine, which isn't that much, but it's enough for now. 
So that'll kind of allow him to keep you up for now. And blue actually getting... Okay, interesting. Purple kind of derping his units too. Wow. Yeah, he didn't actually click on the beacon. Now blue has... Just needs this. That's funny. Actually just gonna go kill the units instead. I like it. So blue actually... Not bad from him. If he goes quick, he could take this. He's going. 20 seconds. Yeah, that should be enough. There he goes. And white kind of posturing. Deciding what to do. Probably going to go into Asia. Because then he can get the surround on Ukraine by coming in this way. I think that makes the most sense. And yeah, now with tanks, it's pretty secure here. Although that's a lot of stuff. And Orange is posturing up a bit, isn't he? So we'll see. Keep an eye on that one. Uh, so yeah, these guys are somewhat uh, doing what they can to control White somewhat. But he's still getting lots of lings. He's got the upgrade advantage. And those ling upgrades are pretty key. No marine upgrades just yet, but that's alright. Okay, purple might actually try to take out Iceland here. This is actually smart. It's a better position to defend, that's for sure. Looks like white might... oh, he's sieging more. I thought he was unsieging. Okay. So he really wants to hold on to Iceland. But I do like that move, because Ukraine, of course, is much more wide open. White could sweep around and attack that, but up here it's a lot harder, because you get tanked all the way down here, and it's just hard to get up there efficiently. Uh, so yeah, he does go for Asia. Tons and tons of lings, as you can see. And I'm just going to get more territory. Uh, you could take out blue. He's got to be careful here, blue. You gotta be careful. Yeah, he does back off. That's smart. Uh, I mean, <laughs> it's not really much blue can do if white decides to attack him, but oh, he does too. Oh boy. Poor blue! Why you gotta do him like that? Look at the onslaught. It's just not fair. It's just not fair, Captain. So we got one Goliath, Billy. No! Oh, nice maneuver. He could actually escape. Looks like he might. And yeah, there goes this too. Okay. Missed that battle, but uh, pretty obvious. The wings ran in, the Goliaths ran in, and no marine upgrades. That's kind of how that. Oh, he does have plus three. Okay, so. Yeah, so he did do some good damage to the glass at least, but the lings seem to soak up most of that. And white finishing that off. Did the Goliath escape? It looked like no. It looks like it died to probably some lings. So he's got Australia. Orange did a nice job there, I gotta say. Uh, no marine upgrades. Plus four, okay, so he's starting those. 10 armor. Okay, that's how he did it then. Ah, that's pretty smart actually. He saw the tank wall and marines, no glass, so what do you do? You get armor on your lings and the marines barely do any damage and the tanks also do not too much damage either. So I guess they would have been doing uh, 90. Or yeah, 90. So they're half damage to light. Oh, but of course he's got upgrades. Let's see here. No, so they would have been doing uh, 110. No, one, 130. No, <laughs> 120. 120 per shot to a single wing. So, 500 health. That's actually not bad. Wings, of course, is how you counter tanks, because, yeah, they get right on top of them, and tanks splash friendly units, so, gotta be careful.
Uh, but yeah, White's still clearly in the lead. He's got a nice tank wall here. This probably won't be broken. He's got plus 9 now, and plus 3, and still 7-5. Yep. So, yeah, no way he's going to push into here. And if he decides to, it's suicide. And he does, okay, pretty wise. He evacs all this stuff. I like it. Giving up a little aggro, but uh, shit happens. Oh, no. Nope. Okay, yeah. Does pick off those marines. Some lings here. So a little more aggro that he's missing. And he does get it, too. Yeah, you can't really blame him. It's hard to notice every little unit as you're evacuating. Uh, but yeah, that's a solid wall. Not getting through that. He's even beefing up this. Everyone's kind of against him, so he's got to kind of at least hold on to one or two continents while his Goliath ball keeps building up. Oh wow, he hasn't actually got a probe yet. I'm surprised. Only blue has. That's actually pretty funny. And he's already uh, four-fifths, or not four-fifths, one-fifth. One-fifth mind on that. So, interesting stuff from Blue. He's got the lights pumping out. Uh, looks like White's just going to take him out, though. That's kind of harsh. Poor guy. Maybe. He's ready to run, at least. Okay. Oh, he is going. <laughs> run, dude, run! Get out of there! Oh, he does. Yep, yeah, nice job. I like it. Uh, I don't know if you want to go this way, though. It's better, I guess, but... Yeah, you can hold on to Ukraine, but now Purple's tanks. And now, of course, White has Asia, which is even better than uh, Europe. Oh boy, and this is a deadly attack because only plus one. So those Marines only doing 11 damage. Oh, and he has plus 10 now, too. So those Marines only doing 6 damage. Not very efficient, sadly. Nice job running the Lings to recapture, but kind of derping also. <laughs> that was funny. Uh, so yeah, nice job with those Lings. Totally disrupting. Uh, I'd probably go this way, actually. Yeah, he does. Nice. Notices those Goliaths and changes course. Oh, there's more here, though. Oh, boy. So he probably doesn't want to lose all his lings, and he does just run. He just runs past. Yeah, I like it. Pretty smart. Keeps his lings alive. His critical lings in blue. Yeah, blue actually did disrupt Asia. Can't blame white. It's quite difficult to hang on to Asia. Uh, should probably mass marines here. He does notice. It just lets it go. Okay, whatever. He's not much of an Australian player. <laughs> he doesn't care. So, yeah, cleaning up that. Wow, these Goliaths were following that. Okay. So, eight Goliaths. I think that is still the most. Yeah, Orange has like six or seven. Yeah, seven. One's virtually dead. And, uh... Purple. How many does purple have? It's a weak one. And so six. He does have Asia, though. You can't, uh... Nice tank line, too, really. These are quite undefended here, but, uh... The rest of this stuff, pretty solid. Uh, of course, White could break into that, no problem. But he's distracted for the time being, and Red now back in it. I guess Red just rebelled. So, just kind of a matter of, uh, the finishing blow for White, but, uh, gotta be careful. Orange has recaptured North America. Ooh, plus 11. There you go. That's more like it. Ah, uh, yeah. 
So actually, technically, in terms of continents, Orange is in a bit of better position. He's getting way more Marines than White is. But uh, just the build-up and accumulation that White's had all game definitely gives him the edge. I'd imagine experience overall, too. Orange does seem pretty good, though. He's, he's done well all game, for the most part. So i got to give him credit. All of uh, all of White's Goliath still pretty he healthy too, so hasn't wasted much money on those. Still no probe. That's very curious. Even purple now getting one. Orange been mining a little bit. Blue almost out, sort of. Two thirds, or no, that's not right. Three fifths. Similar, but not the same. Um, yeah, okay, nice little ling ball here for orange. You will probably want to get uh, attack on those, but not for now. And white kind of has had enough of all this 3v1ing, so he's just chilling out now. No need to really push out and get Asia and Australia taken. This is pretty nasty. Good old camp fest in, in Africa. Even got a bit here in case. And he's got more lings. So. Oh, purple. What just happened? I'm confused. Don't know why he's pulling back into... Okay. Interesting. Okay. Maybe he's got to go AFK for a bit. <laughs> Who knows? Or he's just trying to seem not very strong, not, not in the game. Interesting stuff. I don't know. He's looking. Where is he looking? He's looking all around. So he's definitely not AFK. Let's see if his screen stays here for a while or not. Nope. Still looking around. So I guess he's just kind of waiting on others to see what they do. I'm not too sure. Pretty funny though to set all your units over here. He's just watching the battles, that's what he's doing. And the fact that orange is going to be losing lings to purple is <coughs> it's pretty good for uh, white, really. So it looks like his plan could be working out here. Oh boy. Oh boy. What is this, huh? What is all this? Getting tanks so that orange can't really do that. Can't say I blame them. Bunch of food for some glass. Om nom nom. And yeah, we're kind of just waiting for the uh, the white versus orange inevitability here. Because even though purple does have uh, Europe, not too sure what you can do with it here. Unless he holds it for a long time and just gets a crazy amount of ling and stuff. But we'll see. We'll see what he does. This is pretty campy here. Uh, plus four, zero, zero. 
plus 8, 11, and... Okay, 15, 8. That is quite good. I like that, Orange. You got my attention there. Still no probe. And white... Oh, he just did. So there he goes, finally. Uh, okay, red left. So blue can actually get Asia now. It's probably where white wants to run into Asia once again. Because... Well, I guess he's not too worried about it, though, right? He might even let Blue hold on to Asia for a little bit. Who knows? Uh, this is going to be too much for Blue. So, okay, let's get some more here. Probably going to need more, though. There's two wings. Blue does have upgrades, though, so... Okay, that'll probably turn the tide. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there's still a wing? Yep. <laughs> that hurts. Or Blue wasting all his money on Lings when you could have just ran, ran these in there? Jeez. <laughs> he sends the Lings. Kill it. Kill it. There you go. Beautiful. You have Asia. But for how long? Making more Lings? Yeah. Not what you want to be spending your money on. Is he like planning to recall with this or something? What is what is this? Oh, he does have. Okay, maybe that's his plan. He's just waiting until orange slips up or gets any big attack, and and after that he'll recall. Ugh. I don't know though. This is getting a little silly. Not too sure why he decided to just hang up the towel and chill out for. 10 minutes. Because he is letting Orange kind of... I mean... Yeah, he is technically ahead. Definitely got more territory. Definitely getting more Marines. So, technically ahead in that regard. And he's got the Marine upgrades where White has only plus 6. So, there's an advantage there. The only advantage for White is that he has a... <laughs> he blocked himself off. Uh, is that he just has that accumulation factor. All the lings he's built up. And Goliaths. 13-6 on his lings. 15-10. So even Orange is ahead in the ling department. Uh, looks like he wants to hit purple though. So this could get a little messy. There he goes. He's got sick upgrades, so he's probably doesn't even need these tanks, but the tanks are what... Uh... Oh yeah, he needs them for these, though. Good call. I like the way Orange is playing here. Yeah, and he's going to get tons of gas from that, too. I like it. Uh, Goliaths are going to clean it up somewhat, but the wings get on top. I like it. Well done, man. Orange knows what's up. He does indeed. Making more tanks, but it's getting shot. Okay, there he goes. Sieging, unsieging. More lanes. He's got more back here. <coughs> as well, as well as a tank. Uh, okay, so the glass do cleaned up, but he killed like four or five, I believe. And he sieged up here, so Goliaths can't push him there with all the Marines. <sighs> and yeah. Nice little attack. Didn't lose too much money, just like, I guess, 70 or so for the tanks. But he didn't lose any Goliaths, right? That's kind of the main point. Goliaths, of course, cost 50. Oh, he's got plus 18, too. Yikes. So he knows, man. He knows the, the numbers. That's how you one-shot a Ling right there. He knows what's up. So he's ahead on all the upgrades by a pretty significant amount. And white is... Okay, he's plus 20, though, so never mind. 
they're pretty much identical on the mech, and Orange has a slight upgrade advantage on the infantry and zerglings. It's a lot of stuff here, though. Oh boy, oh boy, can someone get on with it? <laughs> really don't want this to be a big camp fest. Come on, boys. What are you doing down there, White? Sitting on your ass? You're not even killing the lagger. You're letting him build tanks on you. Jeez. Maybe he's recalling these lings. Maybe that's his plan. It's pretty prime recall ball. But nope, just sitting there. No immediate plans. He's just mining up minerals. Okay, there's some action. I like it. Kill the lagger. Hasn't really been that bad all game, but... Kill him. Getting rid of all the tanks, I guess. Blue not even <laughs> finally moves. Took him a little moment there to realize. Hey, my Asia. That's mine. But white disagrees. Could take out this too. Not a bad option. But just gonna run, save what he can. Oh, no, he's going this way. Okay. Oh, is he really about... No, he's not attacking that way. Okay, he's just taking out tanks. Fair enough. Lured the Goliaths away, and now uh, killed a few tanks. Pretty good. Gonna get one more. Nice, nice. Two more? No. Okay, Blue's got some upgrade up... Uh, up, 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 upgrades. Oh, and Orange went down here with Goliath this time. Oh boy. A little overcommitted, though. That's a lot of dead Goliaths from him. So I guess he moved these at some point. Because those are the same Goliaths. And they're virtually all dead now. So I gotta say, White's plan kind of worked out. Just lay low, mine up your minerals. And uh, let the other dudes kill each other, and then you can swoop in with all your lings. It's a pretty fool's, fool's proof plan, I'd say. Nice job from Orange, though. I mean, I don't know if you really needed to do that, but you got it done. And purple is being a bit of a nuisance with these tanks. Pretty awkward to get in here and take out Europe. 15-15 now, that's quite aggressive. 55 damage. And if you did not know, Cracklings have the fastest attack in StarCraft. Even faster than Stim Marines, can you believe it? They attack quite fast. Getting cheeky, but the Goliaths are there. And when will he recall? We do not know. He probably doesn't even know. The future is uncertain, friends. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. This is actually really weak, isn't it? 
I haven't really thought about that, but uh, if he wanted to send Lings that way, he would easily get through that stuff. 13-11, so... Um, basically negating that plus 11 on the Marines. <coughs> More attacks here for me. Orange, okay, he's getting here, so he's probably going to get tanks here. Maybe. Ooh, purple getting shot at. Derping that Goliath a little bit. There goes blue lagging a bit again. I'd love to see it. Somehow he's actually kept Asia. Even though he hasn't been uh, under attack really, other than yellow or white a little bit. It's uh you gotta give props, man. Asia is the hardest to hold, so can't uh, can't fault him for that. But what will he do with it? Is the question. He has uh, he has twelve glass though, so. That's pretty dank, isn't it? That's some dank Goliathage. Nice job from purple, preventing the tank up from orange. But orange doesn't seem to care, he's just uh, wants to keep pushing forward. So it looks like he made a bunch of new Goliaths. Good stuff. Nice tank spread. Holy cow. It's going to be awfully annoying to attack into that. Lings, of course, they do uh, provide an answer, though. That's a nice wall, too. It's pretty secure. Uh, a lot of uh, Lings could definitely kill this, but... Instant DPS is what this is all about. Definitely want, wouldn't want to send a Goliath in there, that's for sure. Is he on the move yet? Are you going to move your Goliaths up, bruh? He's got plus 24. And there's the Arbiter. Okay. So he finally moved the Arbiter out. What's he going to do? Finally getting the Lings organized and ready to move out. There he goes. Oh boy, he's getting shot at. Oh boy, you're just in range. No. Still in range? Nope. Good. Send the lings. Send the boys. Here they go. Uh, I guess he's just killing some tanks, just for starters. He could actually just kill the tanks with the arbiter. It's hard to uh, hard to shoot that far with your Goliaths when the arbiters are trolling on the water, so you could just do that, especially this side here. Takes four shots. Actually, no, not with uh, four armor. Oh, he's really sending his arbiter. Uh, careful, bro. You really need that stasis that bad? Okay. Well, he gets it clean. No shots were fired. And that's going to be a quick cleanup. You can just totally surround the, uh, the five that are frozen. Nice upgrades, though, from Blue. Too bad he got a little lit up here. Oh, he's got six more, though. So he had his pack 12 split up. I forgot he had 12. Now, this is just going to be too much. Luckily for him, though, uh, Stasis does not uh, allow another player to take your beacon. So, okay, yeah. Quickly dying, though, is blue. That hurts. And now white finally freed this up so we can merge Africa and Australia. And this is still quite secure, so that's not going to get attacked. And he kind of played it well, gotta say. Quite patient indeed. Perhaps a little too patient for for my liking, just because I'm watching. But 
fair play. Uh, but yeah, it worked out because Orange wasted a lot of resources fighting Purple. Uh, but he did succeed, so he kind of killed two birds with one stone in that uh, Purple's now dead and Orange now has virtually no Goliaths. So, yeah, pretty smart. Pretty smart how it all turned out. Purple's now dead. He's going to be rebelling. And I mean, Blue's basically dead too. He's got those Goliaths somewhere. Yeah, okay, he's up here. So he does have tanks. He's got a ragtag army. <clears throat> but, uh, okay, yeah, 245 minerals for white, so he's been saving. He can instantly re remake a bunch of Goliaths. He actually only has 10, so might as well get the. Oh, there's the last two. Okay. They're weak, so I guess he wants to make two fresh ones. Uh, can get some aggro here. Blue does notice though. Oh, he's actually on this way. Okay, so just like I said, that pure marine wall was a little weak, but okay, they did hold. Plus 11 still, but they did hold. And actually, that's not bad for orange because it opened up the tank line here, so. <clears throat> If by a miracle he did have a bunch of wings ready to attack, this would be the moment, but I don't think he does. He does have Europe, though, so, I mean, in terms of continents, you can clearly see he's ahead. Not bad from Orange. But he just lost so much money to the Goliaths, and now he's, yeah, almost out of money. White, still 200, but he is almost mined out as well, so... That's not the end of the world for Orange. He's really just got to make sure... Uh, yeah, he can't really hold Europe is the thing. Would be nice though. <sighs> if he could hold on to it, that would definitely be critical. He'd be getting four lings to whites only two, so... <clears throat> That would go a long way. Surprised uh, White actually didn't take Ukraine yet, but I guess he feels confident that he can kill Orange at will. We'll see. Not sure this is necessary, but okay. Better safe than sorry. Um, yeah, I mean, just considering the fact that, uh, Orange spent all that Goliath money to kill Purple, who's now being annoying, uh, just sucks for him, because he's got to face White, who really hasn't lost any Goliaths. I think literally, actually, he hasn't. And because of that, just the momentum swing. Way, way in the favor of White. Tons of lings, tons more lings, and uh, it's going to be a rough time. Yeah, purple being super annoying now, holy cow. Did a lot of damage to that Goliath, though. Marines versus Goliaths is a pretty good time. Lings versus Goliaths is not enough. There we go. He does have more glass than he built. So he's stomping up the rebellion. Which is what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. Kills the weak one. I like that. And he's got the clear upgrade advantage over purple, that's for sure. So instantly gets that cleared up. But here comes white man. Oh, yeah, he's gonna be careful. Oh, he's trying to stasis again. That is dangerous, man. Holy cow. Arbiters are not cheap. 100 minerals, 50 gas. Quite a bit. Nice siege up. I like that. Um, 
So at least he didn't just sit here with the tanks. I like that. Uh, okay, yeah, this is this is very smart because now it forces uh, forces blue to head into orange. So pretty uh, pretty cheeky. Not too sure if he was meaning to do that, but that's what happens when you flush out a, an enemy who has a lot of glots. They head to they head towards your uh, other enemies, and then you can kind of plot them against each other that way. So he's got Asia now. And there it is, that bonus. He's sieging up. Oh boy, yeah, don't do it, Blue. Save what you can. If I was him, actually, with this number, I'd get two dropships and, uh, yeah, just basically chill over water and pick a moment to drop into Australia or Africa or even just uh, constantly run in and out, try to get aggro where you can. Because this is not going to work, especially not long term. No, it's not. White is going to hunt you down with inevitability. Oh boy, you don't want to go this way either. Oh boy, now you're stuck. Nowhere to go. Oh, you didn't cut him off really though. So Blue is going to escape. Forced to run this way again. This time not going to take out Orange, I like that decision. He really doesn't want to piss people off. So it's almost better to, yeah exactly, just chill in the middle here. This is why drop trips are a good idea, because you can totally get out of harm's way. You can even land on this uh, landing pad here. And then Arbiters can't shoot you out of the sky. Oh, going for Africa. Oh boy, this is not going to work though. And now he's just totally trapped himself. So I'm not sure I like this. Oh, maybe he's got a recall though. Does he have a recall? I don't think he does. He totally trapped himself. I don't know why he decided to do that. But okay. Rest in peace, Blue. Nowhere for you to go. Oh boy. Not sure that. Oh, okay, fair enough. I'm not sure you really need to stasis when you have all the tanks, but. He opted for minimal damage. How can you blame him? Okay, Orange now getting in the mix. Hey man, Orange has been making moves. He's. I mean, he's got half the map, so yeah. Nothing to laugh at. Now taking out tanks. You know, tanks taking out marines, only plus seven, so they do quite well still versus those marines. I uh, did have a Goliath in the mix, so easy to take that out. And right after it cleans up Blue's Goliaths, he's ready to hunt down Orange now. This is nice though. This is very nice. Problem is, it doesn't take out Ukraine, and if you don't secure Ukraine, you can come this way few tanks there but not enough and only seven goliaths not gonna be quite enough versus all these lings props to orange though he's been doing quite well let's see if he can uh, pull off a miracle here I feel like he actually could if he uh, masked up more lings here but he's just uh, Taking out purple kind of took a toll on him, so he just hasn't quite haven't had enough time yet. And this isn't really that secure either, so white could come up this way again. I mean, it's pretty good, right? But once you got these this armor, uh, the lings can definitely tear through that. Okay, arbiter. Oh, he's just sending it to Africa for now. Which means you might recall like somewhere in here or in North America here. We'll try and keep an eye on that. Uh, probably should take out Asia though. We're gonna want that extra ling income. 
because orange could catch up if you're not careful. Not too sure how good his Ling Micro is and control, but I guess we're about to find out. Yeah, pretty good game here though, I gotta say. Not not really much camping. I mean there's there's this and there was some tanking going on, but nothing overly crazy. Purple did his thing, but Orange uh, just slowly dismantled it with Lings and, and Glass. And yeah, it's been a pretty good game. White was definitely... Oh, we did recall here. Okay. That's pretty brutal, because now he just tanks up, and yeah, not much he can really do. Losing his Glass, too, that is not what you want to do. When there's all these white Glass ready to take you out. He did do a lot of damage though, I gotta say, considering he had less glass. It's not too bad. Uh, and if he just gets enough links, he could definitely take that out. Just gotta bring all this over. Convert all these to links, bring them over. Okay, he's doing that. Good stuff. He's got a glass here. Making more tanks, but uh, it's gonna be costly if he over invest in just this one spot. Um, with that being said, Orange is going to need a lot to take it out. So We'll see, man. We'll see. It's quite the thorn. Uh, the only good thing is that he did recall all his Goliaths, so not really much for White in terms of taking out Asia. I mean, he's got Ling, so I guess he can just do that, but Yeah, I don't know. I guess Orange just doesn't even care. Yeah, I kind of like that, actually. Just whatever. You can have have North America. I don't care. I'm just going to go take out Asia, then. I like that decision. And he does have the uh, Ling advantage, I believe, over White. Uh, I don't think he wants to do this, though. There's a Goliath here. Even though it's low health, yeah, you don't want to do that. Luckily, he saves what he can. And, uh, yeah, just, just take out blue, man. You can get some aggro, get more territory. I like that idea. You don't have to go for Australia right away. Especially if you keep blue down here, then he's going to kind of be forced to attack white more than you. Uh, not that he can really attack this anyways, but if white's, like, grabbing this, then back and forth between blue and white, something like that. I don't know. Okay, he is moving though, so it's not merely just a camp, which is a pretty big problem for Orange. Not looking good now. Uh-oh. And I'd imagine, yeah, it looks like probably South America now. If he takes out South America, he can sandwich uh, Peru. Yeah, that's Peru. No, no. This is Brazil. Peru. Argentina's down here. Brazil. I guess Peru's here, right? So this is Ecuador? I think that's how it works. Uh, okay, it's just tanking up there instead. Interesting. Not sure why he didn't... Oh, he did actually take that. Okay. So preventing the Ling income, pretty smart. I mean, technically, Orange still has uh, the same number of Ling income, though. Uh, I think... Five Marines? Four Marines? Is it five? No, I think it's four. So White is getting two more Marines to to uh, orange is four. Well, that's not a big deal, of course. This is the problem now. Taking out this is pretty key. Nice job with the stims there. Actually, probably going to take that out. He did some nice Goliath micro too. Wow, orange. Look at that. Pretty good stuff for orange. Uh, and that is actually... A lot more significant than you might think, because 
White is pretty much out of links. He's got a few here. Yeah, well done, man. Uh, all the glass are over here. Looks like he's going to push into South America. Purple's lagging out. Uh, wow, interesting stuff, man. He cleared that up. Uh, this is going to be easy clean. you got to save this. That's pretty key, actually. A lot of lings there. Oh, boy. That sucks. That's too bad for orange. You didn't notice that. I think you got some decent damage on the glass. Not really. Even. So, yeah, that's pretty brutal. At least you can get North America back. Oh, purple. Oh, no. That's so annoying for orange, man. Holy cow. It's been him in purple all game. And now is no exception. Silly, silly purple. Putting white even farther ahead. Feels bad. Maybe he just drops. Like this from blue. At least blue's helping out. At least blue recognizes the true threat. Oh god, purple. Why he do this? That hurts, man. That hurts. Taking out Alaska. Pretty annoying for orange, actually, because now white has another avenue to get up there. And Orange is trying, man. He's trying to regroup, figure out what he can do. I like this little wall here. And he is still holding this, but for how long is the question. Still got his Arbiter as well. Oh, he can just shoot the tanks. That's true. <laughs> this is going to piss Blue off, that's for sure. <laughs> He's just going to shoot it. What? Just shoot it. <laughs> Stasis is. Okay. There's no Goliath, just go shoot it. Alright, go in with Ling's then. He's got Goliaths too, so can clean it up no problem. He could have just shot it with the Arbiter though. People don't think of that. It's only four shots to kill a tank. Except for uh, Blue has upgrades on his tank, so. Five shots. Five shots to get that a thousand health. Who said now? Is that purple? Now. Purple says now? To who? I guess to white? <laughs> purple wants orange to die? That's funny. So orange is kind of still ahead ish in terms of uh, territory and stuff. White still has the momentum with all his Goliaths still and his upgrades now. Close game though, man. This is a good one. It's definitely coming down to this last uh, end game here and with everyone mined out that's uh, also a big factor. <coughs> okay, finally White's going for Asia, which is pretty key. And the fact that purple took this out is pretty essential. Because now white can uh, go that way if he wants. So purple really did kind of screw up orange once again. Too bad, so sad. Yep, yeah, we'll take out blue. And once white gets Asia, that's, that's pretty... Uh, Pretty rough for Orange because he's really been relying on the fact that White doesn't have too much Ling income. And saying that, I mean, he's even had two per round anyway, which is really enough as is. But now he's going to have four. He's going to have four in a little bit. Uh, probably would have gone for these Lings first, but. I guess he's going to go for Alaska. 
No, surely not. Maybe he is. Maybe he's going for Alaska. No, he's going to secure Alaska. He's going to tank up in Kamchatka. No avenue for Orange. So then he can focus on Western Asia. Fair enough. Classic me, not a not a fan of all the tanks, but uh, it is pretty effective. You can't deny that. Like this, how do you attack this? You need like 50 lings at least. Uh, yeah, so at least orange is preventing him for now, but it's not going to be long. It's got Marines sending up there now. Jeez, I wonder if I'm lagging. Keeps showing up as blue or purple, but doesn't mean it's not me. I don't know. Guess we'll find out after. I'll message some dudes. Uh, man, this is interesting stuff. Still hasn't taken out Brazil. Still sitting on those tanks. Not many lings, so he's really rallying as many lings as he can this way. Oh, he's going for the stasis. This is pretty key. Little orange notice. He does. Oh boy. Oh boy. Shoot him. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Well done, man. Orange is on the ball. So that's a pretty big hit, clearly. Um, it's not the end of the world, right? I mean, one Arbiter costs a lot, but really all you're getting out of it is Stasis and Recall, which Recall hasn't really been a thing other than uh, over here. So That being said, though, it's, uh, it's a pretty good pickoff, that's for sure. He didn't even, didn't even get the Stasis off, and, uh, and yeah, he didn't... Uh, He didn't uh, lose anything. He just sniped it out of the sky. Well done from Orange, man. And nice tank up, too. He's got lots of lings, so he can actually defend against White here. I'm impressed, dude. I'm impressed. Tanks here. Um, yeah, man. Wow, and he's... Redefending here now. Not that White is really planning to head that way, but uh, hmm, he's got two healthy Goliaths here. I don't know if I'd. Why not leave the. Are they all healthy? Oh, they are. Okay. Fair enough. He's got no weak Goliaths. Down here, I guess he probably does. But how do you bring that to Kamjaga is the question. They're not even that weak, really. 2,000 health, that's a lot still. Uh, yeah, man, bit of a standstill, but uh, pretty critical moment. Oh, he runs past the tanks, that hurts. Don't do it with the glass. Oh, no, dude. Okay, not too bad. Only a few shots on the glass. But, uh... It does take out Ukraine. But it's not... Oh, okay, he's making tanks. Uh, yeah, okay. That is going to be pretty... Okay, that hurts, though. That hurts to just lose them. And now we're going this way. Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, no. I guess he got some tank kills. And at least he killed these tanks. Purple keeps saying now. <laughs> I'm not sure what Purple's talking about. And, uh... Oh, no! White, uh... White's the winner after Orange leaves. 
Bummer. That was a good game, man. You played well. Too bad he had to leave. It wasn't over by any means. Um, nice job, though. He took Ukraine in the end and defended Australia. Pretty uh, pretty derpy attack with the Lings there. Probably didn't want to do that. but Yeah, just white and purple. And purple kept saying now. <laughs> but now he's just doing whatever. <laughs> And yeah, so purple is just AFK, I guess. So yeah. Easy, <laughs> what? Yeah, so well, it's all over. Purple's AFK, so I guess I'm just going to tap out. It was a good game. Orange put up a good fight. He picked off that Arbiter. He did some other stuff. So, uh, yeah. I like the way he played overall. White, of course, wins. There's no way or uh, Purple's coming back in, so I'm not sticking around. Not really pointing that, is there? Yeah, man, too bad he had to leave. Uh, I do kind of feel like White still had the game. Uh, he felt that way as well, but uh, Orange was putting up a fight. That's for sure. And that is for sure. All right. I guess it was a bit of a long, a bit of a long one, wasn't it? But that's all good. That's how risk goes. One hour, it's not too bad in the in the land of risk. Alright, GG.